Gideon was a man admired for his kindness, affection, and attention to detail. His relationship with Sarah had once been a model of love and romance. They spent countless joyous moments together, sharing dreams and creating memories that seemed destined to last. Gideon's caring nature complemented Sarah's charm perfectly. However, beneath the surface, Sarah had a growing desire for a life of opulence and luxury. Despite Gideon's success and his efforts to provide a comfortable life, Sarah felt he couldn't offer the extravagance she craved. Their relationship began to fray as Sarah's quest for a wealthier lifestyle grew stronger. One evening, Sarah made a painful confession, she was leaving Gideon for a richer man who could give her the luxury she desired. The news shattered Gideon's world. Watching Sarah walk away, Gideon was left with only the echoes of a love that had once seemed perfect, now replaced by a deep, aching void. Devastated by the breakup, Gideon sought solace in the dimly lit confines of a local bar. The bar, with its melancholic ambience and the steady clink of glasses, offered a temporary escape from his relentless sorrow. Each night, as he nursed his drink, he couldn't help but notice a solitary woman at the bar, drowning her own troubles in alcohol. Her constant presence and sorrowful demeanor piqued Gideon's curiosity. He watched as she repeatedly sought refuge in the bar's hazy embrace, her grief evident in every glass she emptied. One evening, driven by a mix of empathy and intrigue, Gideon decided to approach her. Her name was Mercy. He hoped to understand her reasons for frequenting the bar and, perhaps, find some comfort in connecting with someone who seemed to understand the depths of heartache. Mercy, like Gideon, was nursing wounds from a recent breakup. Her previous relationship had been marked by manipulation and cruelty, ending in a bitter and painful separation. As they spoke, Gideon and Mercy found an unexpected connection in their shared experiences of betrayal and loss. Both had loved deeply, only to have their hearts broken by those they had trusted. Their conversations became a refuge where they could express their pain and seek understanding. The bond between them grew stronger with each meeting. They found solace in each other's stories, their shared heartbreak creating a space where they could support one another. Their connection, born out of mutual suffering, evolved into a friendship grounded in empathy and shared experiences, offering a glimmer of hope in the midst of their personal trials. Seeing an opportunity to offer some comfort, Gideon invited Mercy to his home. He wanted to create a space where she could find solace and distraction from her pain. Although hesitant at first, Mercy accepted the invitation, and her visits soon became frequent. With each visit, she brought warmth and care into Gideon's life. She cooked for him, took on household chores, and became a steady presence in his otherwise empty home. Her commitment was a stark contrast to Sarah's previous indifference. While Sarah had been dismissive and demanding, Mercy's actions demonstrated genuine care and dedication. Gideon began to appreciate how Mercy's hard work and thoughtfulness made his home feel alive again. Her presence filled the void left by Sarah's departure, and Gideon found himself increasingly grateful for the comfort and support she provided. Despite the deepening bond between them, Mercy remained adamant that she was not interested in pursuing another relationship. She had been deeply hurt and was focused on her healing process. Yet, as weeks went by, Gideon and Mercy's friendship grew into something more profound. Mercy's kindness and dedication began to have a significant impact on Gideon. He realized that she was everything Sarah was not, compassionate, humble, and genuinely affectionate. The contrast between Mercy's genuine care and Sarah's previous superficiality became increasingly evident. Gideon found himself drawn to Mercy, recognizing in her a rare and valuable partner. The more he saw of Mercy's true nature, the more he appreciated her. Despite her insistence on remaining single, Gideon couldn't ignore the growing feelings he had for her, which had transformed their friendship into something meaningful and significant. After weeks of growing closeness, Gideon decided to take a bold step. 
He gathered his courage and confessed his feelings to Mercy, asking her to be his girlfriend. He promised to cherish and never hurt her, hoping to build a relationship based on mutual respect and love. Mercy was taken aback by Gideon's heartfelt confession. Although she had sworn off relationships due to her past pain, she couldn't deny the sincerity and depth of Gideon's feelings. She saw in him a man who was rare and worthy of a second chance. After careful consideration, Mercy accepted his proposal, acknowledging the difficulty of finding someone as caring and genuine as Gideon. Their relationship began to blossom, marked by a deepening connection and mutual understanding. This new chapter in their lives held the promise of healing and happiness, built on the solid foundation of their shared experiences and newfound love. As Gideon and Mercy's relationship grew, they began to plan their future together, including their wedding. Their happiness was evident in every shared moment and in their excitement about the future. Just as they were preparing for this new chapter in their lives, an unexpected knock came at Gideon's door. To his shock, it was Sarah, looking disheveled and remorseful. Her sudden reappearance brought back a flood of memories and emotions for Gideon. Sarah's presence was a stark reminder of the pain she had caused and the luxury-driven life she had chosen over their genuine love. She confessed that her new life with a wealthier man had been far from the paradise she had anticipated. She had been mistreated and undervalued, and she now regretted leaving Gideon. Her plea for forgiveness and a second chance came as a surprise, throwing a wrench into the plans Gideon and Mercy had so carefully crafted. Sarah, visibly distressed and regretful, revealed that her new relationship had not met her expectations. The wealthier man she had left Gideon for had treated her poorly, failing to value her in the way she had hoped. Realizing her mistake, Sarah came to plead with Gideon for another chance, hoping to rekindle what they once had. Her confession was filled with sorrow and regret, and she desperately sought Gideon's forgiveness. She hoped that by returning to him, she could mend the broken pieces of her life. However, Gideon had already moved on. He had found true love with Mercy, who had shown him the value of genuine care and respect. Gideon's heart was now fully committed to Mercy, and he was not willing to jeopardize their future for Sarah's fleeting regret. Gideon, with Mercy by his side, listened to Sarah's pleas but remained resolute. He had found genuine love and happiness with Mercy, who had been a constant source of support and affection. Together, they made it clear to Sarah that their wedding was imminent and that there was no place for her in their lives. The decision was firm, Sarah's attempts to reclaim a past that had been left behind were not welcome. They asked her to leave, firmly closing that chapter of their lives. Gideon's focus was now on building a future with Mercy, and he was determined not to let Sarah's past mistakes interfere with their happiness. This final confrontation was a decisive moment, marking the end of an old chapter and the beginning of a new, promising future with the person who had truly proven her worth. With Sarah's departure, Gideon and Mercy could finally focus on their upcoming wedding. Their hearts were filled with hope and love as they moved forward with their plans. The wedding was not just a celebration of their union but also a testament to their journey from heartache to true happiness. It marked the beginning of a life filled with love, respect, and mutual support. Their shared experiences and the way they had supported each other through their pain made their bond even stronger. As they looked forward to their future together, they were grateful for the lessons learned and the love they had found in each other. Their wedding was a joyful occasion, a symbol of their triumph over past sorrows and their commitment to building a beautiful life together.